Hello everyone and welcome back to Cooter's Cards. We're on our last row of the 1994 Score Series 2 cards. We're uh, opening up on this box and then we'll move on into something else. Still doing this as a distraction for the working at home and the coronavirus stuff. So uh, hopefully you guys enjoy it a little bit and we go on, you know, from here. So we got up a first a Greg Maddox Hall of Fame card. Good opening right out of the top on that box. Carl Rhodes. Kevin Reimer. Tim Shallon. There we go. Finally, a pretty good Gold Rush rookie, a uh, Gold Rush card, not a rookie, but a Hall of Famer, Alan Trammell. So we'll get him down over here with the other guys. Juan Guzman. Dave Hollis. Tim Wakefield, Dean Palmer, Paul Quintrell, Larry Lebers, Carlos Diego, and the Los Angeles Dodgers. I think they're stuck to someone else right now. Been a little bit of a problem with these cards. They're, uh, they still want to stick together. To Turk Wendell, a rookie prospect card. And the Dodgers. And then the team players that are out here. So we got got out today a little bit and uh, went into Walmart and snuck by their baseball counter. And I ended up grabbing a, a couple packs of the, uh, the new the Topps Heritage, the 2020 Topps Heritage. So I think tomorrow, would, even though it's not going to be very much, we'll probably just open those up for tomorrow. Do something a little bit different and uh, just kind of see what everyone thinks about that tomorrow. And like I said, um, if you guys are watching this, hit the like button and uh, and subscribe to the channel and uh, ring the bell in there, I guess, too. And then you get a notice when, we're, uh, when we put something new online, you'll get notification of it. And be able to keep up with what we're doing. Like I said, the um, the big thing we want to do is get into some of the older cards that we have. And um, show off those. And especially even on... If you guys have watched any of um, the other videos that I've done with the cards that were open. Um, if there's anything you need for your collection that you're interested in that we've opened so far... Leave me something in the comments down there and let me know. We'll get you guys hooked up. We'll see what we can uh, do to get some of these out. I know they're uh, kind of the junk wax stuff out there, but if you're um, if it's something you don't have, if there's a team set you want, a player you want, or something else, just let me know and we'll uh, we'll work on something to get everything together. I right, so I get some of these cards. I I bid on some things on auction sites and. Uh, it seems like some of the cards, there's cards that I want that they have in there. And then these some of these boxes just kind of come along with them at a pretty reasonable price. So um, that's where I picked up a lot of these at. Mariano Duncan for the Gold Rush card. So, um, you know, like I said, if there's something you guys want to want to have an interest in, just let me know. And if there's something in the future, too. Um, as we get into some of the other cards that we have, we'll um, let me know on that too, and we'll uh, we'll see what we can work out on that stuff. So, Chip Hale, Nigel Wilson, and Ryan Thompson. I got a feeling probably these cards just didn't go over very well. They put a ton of rookie prospect cards in there. But even though they put like that, the Chipper Jones I pulled out, and he's a Hall of Famer, and they have a rookie prospect card, when you look at their uh, sets, the year before that, they had another card out there with them in there. So they called it a rookie prospect, but the year before that, they had a card out of on him too. So, you know, technically, I think, don't think that would be his rookie card. So I think that just... Uh, probably what got a lot of people frustrated with, all, with these sets on here, because you get all these cards... Gold Rush Howard Johnson. 
and they're not even that much value because it's actually not even their first year card. And I think that's where all the value comes. A lot like the Frank Thomas card, Kurt Gibson. Um, the Frank Thomas card we got out of the, the uh, top set in the um, 91. That's his first picture in a um, White Sox uniform. But they did a card the year before that with him in his Auburn University uniform. So that come, becomes his rookie card. And the next card, even in the White Sox, doesn't draw the same interest, even though depends on how people feel. That could be technically his rookie card. Um, but the first card it seems to be the always thing that drives the market and drives people's interest is the very first card that people have out there. So um, I think that's the same thing they did here. I think they put too many people out here as rookie prospects. And when they don't pan out, then there's just not that much value to the set. And they gave they put a lot of them in here too, so there's probably not really any type of scarce, scarcity to it. We got this card with Joe Carter, the series highlight, series winner card, but now in a gold rush card. Ruben Sierra. Dave Winfield. I think this, uh, well, yeah, that was his uh, season highlight was his 3,000th hit. And we've got, that's the second card like that we picked up out of this box. See the rookie prospects, there's, there's, seems like there's four or five rookie prospect cards in every pack. And most of them you don't even hear about. So, um. Uh, I think that's what got a lot of people just kind of disappointed with them, too. Dennis Martinez. Rafael Palmero. Matt Drews. Brian Anderson. Kevin Moss. Oh, and the back of there is kind of stuck together as a Scott Finley. We won't waste time pulling that apart. Brady Anderson, Julio Franco, Teddy Higuera. There we go. First time we've seen that card out of this box. Ken Griffey Jr., eight home runs in a row. We'll put him down. I think we've got to have a little pile going down here, I thought, with some Ken Griffey Juniors. I'm going to throw him up here with Mike Piazza on the podium. Kevin Stocker, St. Louis, and Scott Ruffcorn, rookie prospects. And like I said, I wanted to open this box up. This was a product I don't think I'd ever opened before, even when it was new. So having the chance to look at the box is the kind of the first time I've even done it. So I just thought it would be um, kind of a neat box to look at. And I think it is. They have some, uh, I like the blue colors and the borders, the white edge, you know, the, the edges on them. Most of them seem to be pretty well-centered cards. There's just nothing there that's um, seems to be a lot of any type of rarity or anything else in there. Felix Jose, Daryl Hamilton, Eddie Zombrero, John Roper, Chicago Cubs, Jim Abbott, season highlight, no hitter, and then the Ton Van Poppel rookie card. We've got quite a few of those. I think there's that little bit of a haze on there because these cards, I had to, I, I was telling you before, I came out and cut the packs open. And uh, flexed them a little bit because the cards are sticking together real bad. And I don't know if that little white haze in some of those cards is what was causing them to stick. If there was a little wax coating or something that melted over time or just kind of fell together. Like that card. There's two cards stuck together there. So um, 
Kirk Presley, Shane Reynolds, rookie prospect, John Smiley, Tony Pena stuck to Roberto Kelly, Will Cordano, Robin Ventura, Jack McDowell, Cy Young Award winner card. I think that's the first time we've seen that out of this box. Lenny Dykstrom, career, high, career highlight card, postseason star. And a Kevin Robinson stuck to a Robert Mejia. So we're not going to waste time pulling those guys apart. And this is the last pack out of this box. And one thing we, like I said, we want to do too is um, Frank Tanana. You guys, if you see the boxes in the background, that's some more of the boxes I pulled out that I want to open up. Um, leave me a comment on what you might like to see in the future. And we'll open that up maybe next starting next week on Monday. Tomorrow, I said, it, I think I'll do a short video tomorrow. I got two packs of the Heritage, the 2020 Tops Heritage cards. I like to open up and it won't take very long. So tomorrow we might do just those two packs and then move into another box for next week through the through our uh, planned coronavirus relief or COVID-19. Um, see there, we got another Chipper Jones rookie prospect card. But even for them, this was the second card, the second year they did that for him. But we got two of them out of the box. It's still got to be a little bit of a good find, I think. And the last card out of here is the John Voigt rookie prospect card. So like I said, take a look in the uh, background there from the upper deck. We've got another box of tops, two different boxes of Fleer, the Leaf set, the studio. And then let me rotate this just a little bit over here. To where I have the Top Stadium Club Series 2, 1994. So let me know what you have. Um, enjoy the rest of the weekend and we'll see you tomorrow.